Alright, g'day fellas, Austin Khan here, welcome to another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. I believe this is part 20... Part 26, I think, I'm not too sure, but anyway, today is Sunday the... Today is Tuesday, the April... April 25th, 2023 is an exact day, and we're about to, about to continue on with Assassin's Creed Origins. So we're about to fast travel to this location, do some more side quests. Which means once we leveled up to level 28, we'll be able to do the next main story mission. I do apologise that getting through the main story of Assassin's Creed Origins does take a while. But, you know, it is what it is. That's what I don't like about this game. I just want to get through the main story done and dusted. Uh, for all of you to enjoy and also for myself to enjoy as well. And of course, I've still got the same gear. I've got some arrows. And of course, I've got the shield that looks very familiar to a Templar shield, so it must belong to a Templar. Um, I haven't changed Bayek's uniform at all, but I did change the horse to a camel, uh, which is pretty cool. And of course, oh, this is the second video for Tuesday, and I might be recording two more videos for the day, which will be uploaded throughout the week. So I'm going to quickly check out the map, see what other missions we have to do. So we have Forging Siwa, so Bex Gold, that's level 27, so it should be okay, and the Sickness at level 26. We're up to level 27, so we should be okay doing the next mission. So we'll come over here, and we'll wait till daytime to do the mission. Alright, cool. So we got to meet our mission just over this way. I see you bear the markings of old Siwa. Is that a real Magi badge? How much would you sell it for? Siwa is my homeland, and it is not for sale. Everything is for sale here. You should visit Valley Market to the east. They have Siwa and treasures, not the normal fake stuff. These are real. I would be interested to meet anyone selling genuine C1 treasures. Are you sure you do not want to sell that badge? No matter. Look for the stall under the bird's nest. You will thank me. Alright, new quest, forging C1. Let's do it. So, we're going to check out the quest. Alright, what does it say? Someone is selling stolen C1 treasures in the... Black market trade by it goes to investigate. <coughs> and that's what we're gonna do. Um probably be up this way, I think. So I think we made Whoa. it, but we just have to go over here. Alright, new location discovered, Valley Market, which is a very cool place. Did you hear about that new stall with the treasures from the temple in Siwa? From a temple? Are you crazy? You don't want something stolen from a god? Wait. Are they real? Why do you think they are so expensive? I would sell my whole life for an Ankh of Amun. <laughs> Welcome. We have many unique treasures for sale. Would you like? This is meant to be genuine, but it's a fake. And not a very good one. It is not fake. It is real. Would you like? This is your store. Yes, mine. Many unique treasures from faraway Siwa. Not fake. Not fake. Have you got anything real? I'm sure these are not your best pieces. What do you mean? These are real. Hmm. More expensive ones at my camp. I can take you. Not far from here. You follow. Sadne 
Magi badge. Not very good, you know. We have better ones. Would you like? I like this one. These are the treasures of yours. Are they fake as well? I told you, not fake. Oh, how did you know? My treasures aren't really real, but not fake. My mother has some real ones anyway. Hey, I have a secret. I was once a Magi in Siwa. I've seen the real treasures. Oh, not fair. I made them all myself, you know. No one else can tell. Do not worry. They are very good fakes. I will not tell anyone. I said, not fake. <laughs> Were you really Magi? Maybe you are fake. <laughs> ah, hey. You're a very cheeky child. Hey, let's see what your mother has. We go along the canal. You lead. I will fake it. Does not even make sense. Be afraid. Lucky for you, I am real. Stay here and keep hidden. What? Alright, do this, fellas. I've got a nice sword. Would you like? Who in Hades are you? Oh yeah, that's what we do, fellas. Two things. I am a liar and you will be me. Your mother's virtue. Um. Take anything you want. As I told them, I do not have any money, but I have many unique treasures from Siwa. Mother, he is not a bandit. He is my friend. Thanks for saving us. I guess you are real. Sorry I said you were fake. He saved us? We have to give him something. We always repay kindness, remember? I've got something. Here. This is a genuine imitation Siwan Kopish. It is very rare. They don't make them anymore. Please, take it with our gratitude. Mother, he already knows. Thank you. I'm honored. Yes, I can tell. This one's really real. There are almost none like it. May you multiply happy years. Alright, quest completed. Oh wow, we're in your sword. That's level 25. Uh, might need to upgrade it. Although are we level 27, so it was that curse. No, I can't take that one. So we'll go to dismantle. Alright, cool. Crafting available. Let's see what we got. What does that do? Hidden blade increases hidden blade damage. Cool. Alright, next mm, quest. I was going to say next map. Next quest we're going to do. Let's do the sickness. We don't really need a camel, so we should be okay. Oh, no. Running corpses. This is blasphemy. Who did this? Oh. Hey, 
Why are you burning the dead? Don't you fear the gods? Their souls will be forever cursed. I'm sorry to do it, but I have no choice in this. The gods themselves have afflicted us with a pestilence. The dead must be burned to save the living. What pestilence? Is there a plague? Truly, I don't know. Elders have begun falling sick. Children have died clutching their bellies in agony as their parents watch on, lifeless in their beds. This would be cruel, even for the angriest of gods. No one cares about us. Any help would be appreciated. In the Fayum, the poor aren't worth spit. Alright, so... We'll stay on foot for now, investigation process. Investigate the strange sickness in the harbour. Alright, so... Let's My children, your here. hunger is known. Turn to Sobek for your nourishment. Another dead farmer whose family there are no will signs of a plague land. on the body. They used to eat at the arms kitchen in the market, but soldiers began harassing them. Greek merchants mm. said they were bad for business. These bowls are filthy. It's this way. What have the villagers been eating? They must have the food stored somewhere. I should have a look around. Come, it's this way. This food is rancid. It smells like shit. It is completely unfit for eating. This gruel is not fit for rats, let alone people. The strong spices are not for taste. They are disguising the rot. I need to talk with whoever made it. Sobek has provided a way. Alright, speak to the Though healer. The food is humble. It gives life. Eat with thanksgiving. Tell me about the food you eat. Where does it come from? A merchant makes it for the poor here. It's not much, but at least it's something. We're thankful. You're welcome to try some. By the gods, no. I do not know how you stomach it. I need to talk to the merchant. Where can I find him? His house is to the south of the town market. I can take you. Let's visit this merchant of yours. I will follow you. May Sobek reward you for helping. I've passed many prosperous farms. People here seem to be doing well. Why are there so many poor? Ah, oh, yes. Those are Greek farms. The Greeks pay lower taxes, so they prosper. Meanwhile, the Egyptian farmers are slowly forced from their lands. What happens to the land when the farmers leave? Once the owners die, by law the land is freed. If it's good land, the Greeks take it. If not, the desert takes it. Either way, Egyptians are left to starve. Many end up in the slums. This is the home of the merchant who provides the food. Even the cats here look better fed than the poor. <laughs> hmm, not much in here we can look for. The owner is obviously of substance. Not all Egyptians seem to be equal. Some are just more equal than others. Alright, here we are. This is awful! No wonder people are falling sick. Who would do this? It is time we met this poisonous merchant. Give him a taste of his own cooking. How may I help you? This is my home. Are you lost? You can explain to me why you have been poisoning the poor. My guess is so you can take their land. It is easier if they are dead. You're referring to the trouble in the slums? Whatever you've heard, I assure you, you misunderstand. I do what I can to help. I have seen your kitchen merchant. I know what you are doing. And I will see that you are brought to justice. Oh, I see. 
Well, that changes things. Now, you're trespassing, and I have the right to protect myself. Men! All right, sword fight. Let's do it. If you were reasonable, I wouldn't have to do this. We could have worked this out. I'm not dying over this. Hold him off. All right, let's go and get this guy. I'm coming for you, buddy. Merchant of death was murdering the poor for their land. His love of money was the real sickness. Fayum won't miss him. The dead can rest. There will be no more Bani. Alright, another mission done and dusted. So we'll head over to Sobek's Gold. That's level 27, so I think we should be okay. Let's go check. Oh, we're halfway to level 27, so that means that we should be able to do the main story mission this weekend, maybe. We'll see what happens. This evil boy has profaned the gods. His punishment will be an example and an atonement. His hands for thievery, his tongue for lying. But I'm telling the truth. Silence, boy! You will not speak. Priest, what has the boy done to deserve this? This has nothing to do with you. Back away. The boy will get what he deserves. I serve so big. I serve so big. I am a slave. Boy, what are you accused of? I was charged with ferrying two gold so bags to Crocodilopolis. Just out of port, my ship sank by the lighthouse. I almost drowned. The statues were lost. I didn't steal them. Silence! And you, step back, Sahedi. Wait. Do not threaten me, Neb. I am a Magi. If the boy speaks the truth, I will find your gold Sobex. If he lies, he is yours to deal with. I should check the big Octarim ship. So Bex gold, the two gold so Bex are near the docks. Alright, so find and get the gold so Bex. Ah, oh, find and get the gold so Bex, alright, that makes more sense. This one's the closest. Alright, so we're on the right place, that's good. Hopefully nothing will attack me. Level 28, damn. Uh-oh. Just gotta be very careful, that's all. quick. We've got the captain, so that's good. Now, question is, can we climb up here? Maybe. Damn it. Got the way? Shipwreck. This could be it. 
A golden statue of Sobek. Beautifully made. Just as the boy said it would be. on me. No one does that. No one. Except for me, maybe. Huh? <laughs> Alright, let's just chill for later. Chill for now. That last dive was a good haul. The gold Sobek will bring a small Level 29. Fortune, Shipwreck might be hiding more. <laughs> Alright, might have to sneak around. Hopefully we can, uh, our increased damage hidden blade can really <laughs> kill him. If not, then we'll probably have to... There. Oh, nice no, carbon crystal. Why does everybody interact with that? Interesting. And of course, another one. The golden statue of Sobek. It is beautiful. The boy tells the truth. I should return these gold sobeks to that odious priest. So that was Priest. pretty stealthy. I have your precious golden sobex. Your novice spoke the truth. This useless boy has been constant trouble. Many more punishments await him for his carelessness. Your beast clothing is just a mask for cowardice! God, the gods, I hate masks. This has nothing to do with you, Saheti. Crawl back into your desert hole! I am Medjai, you dishonorable dog! I have the authority here, Medjai! God! Say what you got. Ah! 
What do I do now? The temple will not accept me. Sobek has left the fate of this gold with you. You can return to the temple, or to your family. The choice is yours. May Sobek be with you. Whatever you do, do it honorably. Egypt needs priests who do not wear masks. Alright, so Beck's goal got 3,000. Wow. We're almost at level 28, so probably next episode we might be able to do a main story quest. So I want to head back and get some stuff ready for the next mission slash video. So I might need some arrows, might need to sell some stuff. Yeah, I need arrows. Which would be cool. Alright, refill, arrows, upgrades, level 27, that's a good weapon, so I'll take that one. Overseer, that's cool. Big game, but we've got those two, so that's okay. Shields, that's, that's the one we've got on. Cool, re-upgrade, that's okay. Sell, what can we sell? That was done. That was done. Mm. Iron. We might use that. Uh, we might keep these for crafting stuff. Headrest. All right. That's that one. Crafting stuff. Animal goods. Oh. And that one. Cool, I think that's about it. Nice, got some more money which is good, which will definitely help us in our uh, next mission that we're going to do. So of course, that's now level 27, and that's now level 27, so that's good. And of course these two are level 27, so that will be a big, big help for us. Alright, so I want to quickly check out the next mission called... Oh crap, we're not able to do those missions. Level 39, damn. And of course we have level 37, so it might be a bit, bit difficult. So that one, the champion, so that might be the next mission to do. Anything in Siwa? Nah. No. Uh, what about over here? Do we have any team missions? No, nothing. Oh hang on, we've got more over here. Oh no, we can't use that one. So we got more First Blood, Rites of Anubis, Ribble Alliance. Can we do that one? Murder in the Temple, and Curse of Wadjet. So we'll go to here. Alright, fellas, well, thank you for watching another episode of Assassin's Creed Origins. I'll be back with another video for what, Tuesday, or well, for today. I am recording on Tuesday, but the videos will be uploaded throughout the week. So anyway, thank you for watching. Until then, I will see you next episode. Peace out, mate.